You may not realize it, but that little Cyclops brick in your pocket and all those other robot devices in your life are emitting this invisible radio frequency and microwaves that have been proven to spaz out your cells. These things, as beautiful and potent as they are in helping us communicate and work through our daily life as modern apes, they have their deleterious effects in our life. And so what do we do about it? Do we just keep working through the anxiety, the insomnia, the infertility they're eliciting on us? No, we don't have to keep working through it and we don't have to go completely Amish mode and throw our cellular devices out the window. We can work with these frequencies by connecting back to nature, which is what my channel is all about. So in this video, we're gonna go through some strategies that can help you mitigate and decrease the potent effects from these EMFs, these non-native EMFs. They're not created by Earth, but created by man and working with them so we can live a longer, healthier, and more vital life. So let's jump into them. Hello, friends in cyberspace, or friends, because I'm probably communicating to one being, one essence, you are right here, right now, in this very moment, in YouTube, the world of YouTube. It's awesome, isn't it? My name is Christian Van Camp. I'm a holistic lifestyle and performance coach, and I've been studying the vast realm of ancestral living and overall modern science and intertwining the two so we as humans can live a more vital life every single day in this crazy chaotic world. And so in this video, one thing that can help us out immensely is connecting back to nature by decreasing the harmful effects coming from electromagnetic frequencies. There is a ton of research coming out more and more every single day on the deleterious effects coming from these devices, 5G, Wi-Fi. You can just look it up yourself on PubMed. I don't need to do that for you. And you may actually be experiencing the issues without even realizing it because they are invisible coming from your Wi-Fi router, coming from all these different things. Even your fridge is emitting it because there's electrical frequencies coming from it. But more so from the little phone we have right now that you're probably watching this video from. So let's start off with number one, which coincides to exactly what I just said. Putting your phone on airplane mode as much as possible, especially for you men, if you wanna live a more fertile life, Putting your phone on airplane mode when it's in your pocket and putting your phone in your back pocket versus the front pocket is going to help immensely because it's right, not going to be right next to the gonads burning up your fertility and your sperm production. And there is research on that. You can even look into Andrew Huberman's work. He had a podcast coming out on all this kind of stuff. So put your phone in airplane mode as much as possible. And this also connects to when you're sleeping. When you go to sleep at night, a non-negotiable every single time I go to sleep is putting it on airplane mode. Don't worry about anyone calling you. You are in your own life. Just keep it on airplane mode. It cuts off the signals and it makes it far less more powerful coming from uh, all these connectivities and these energies and these wavelengths. So put it on airplane mode as much as possible. And on top of that, unplug your Wi-Fi router at night. There's many benefits to doing that. First, it helps you with security. So overnight, it's not even being used, just cut it off from the, the signals. Secondly, it's gonna diminish a lot of these frequencies so you aren't getting zapped by it. There's a massive aura being elicited from these high-powered Wi-Fi routers. So disconnecting your Wi-Fi router at night helps immensely as well. Another strategy to keep in mind is not putting your bed set, your headset, right next to an outlet because those outlets are actually constantly feeding in energy as well. So if your, your head is right next to an outlet, just move it, shift it somewhere in the room where it's not gonna be right up next to that. That can help out a ton. Connecting back to nature. And what do we do? Well, we ground outside barefoot. Yes, the earth is emitting natural EMFs, electromagnetic frequencies that are favorable for our vessels as humans. And it's been shown in many studies to diminish inflammation tremendously. And this can help ward off a lot of the inflammation occurred throughout the day when we're working on our laptops, we have our phones, by getting outside barefoot for a minimum of 30 minutes a day, going on some cool, you know, groundwork of earth, whether it's rocks and rubble, or it's some good nutrient dense soil or grass, even dirt emits a little bit, but if you can go to more nutrient dense areas with some mycelium network underneath and some moisture and some fertility in the soil, that's gonna help you with your fertility and your overall dim diminishment of these electromagnetic frequencies built up over time. Because we build up a lot of positivity from these EMFs that are not made by nature, but made by man, these non-native ones. And so if we can get more of these negative ions from the earth by going barefoot for 30 minutes a day, it's gonna help a ton. I mean, just about every day I'm going barefoot hiking and it really has helped a ton with my stress levels. And not only just the fact that it's gonna help out getting more negative ions and the grounding effects of the earth, it's gonna help you with connecting your feet because that's great for your posture, that's great for your holistic health, is you know really having that foundation with your feet and having the acupressure from the earth. So get outside and ground barefoot. 
On top of going barefoot, get some sun exposure. That is releasing a lot of those healthy photons and that actually will help you as well with boosting melanin which is what gives you the tan skin and helps you get that sexy glow. Melanin works like an antioxidant in the body, so getting some sunshine as well every day if you can will help a ton. Uh, I also use, on days that I don't get enough sun, or every day for that matter, 10 to 20 minutes, I stand full body naked in front of photobiomodulation. Photo meaning light, biobiology, modulating that biology through light, and this is through red light therapy. I absolutely love it. There's a lot of research on this, helping out with your mitochondria, the powerhouses of your cell, helping out a ton with uh, mitigating inflammation, even supporting testosterone levels through other mechanisms and nitric oxide signaling. So I'm a big fan of the most affordable on the market. And on top of that, the most effective because it has the favorable wavelengths that aren't too extreme, like a lot of them on the market, like Juve is just overpowered. So I stick with Gemba Red. It's a really great, powerful company. Uh, and they have full big panels. They have smaller ones for travel and just making it simple. Uh, you can get a full big one for like $350, $400 tops, uh, and it'll last you forever, and there's a great warranty on it. So check out Gemba Red. You can get 10% off with code CVC Wellness. Well, as you probably know, I'm all about that holistic approach as I've explained. And so when it comes to this holistic approach, everything's interconnected. It's similar to the idea that no hormone works in isolation. That's why I'm not a fan of a lot of guys who are super young getting testosterone injections because that hormone and testosterone skyrocketing is gonna affect a whole host of other hormones, therefore causing many issues in the long run with your own endogenous creation from within of testosterone. So that's just a, one example of many. But with that being said, one thing that will help you out with inflammation and warding off the inflammation from EMFs specifically coming from these devices is nutrition, guys. That is so important, it's so paramount, is eating adequate, healthy, antioxidant-rich, healthy fatty acid nutrition. So here's some pointers I will point out to you, just real simple and easy. You can also explore my channel for even more help with nutrition. There's a lot of um, powerful videos I have coming out all the time when it comes to nutrition and uh, optimizing it. But some of the major things you can focus on are antioxidants. So really uplifting the antioxidants. What are some foods rich in antioxidants? Wild blueberries, big fan of that. Avocado, uh, cacao. There's a whole host of foods. You can look online, type in the OROC scale, O-R-A-C, and look up a long list of the high antioxidant foods. Start incorporating more of those on a daily basis. That is antioxidizing from the oxidizing effect from EMS. You can also incorporate more healthy fatty acids. I'm big on smash, coming from fatty cold water fish. Smash, sardines mackerel, anchovies, salmon, wild caught sockeye salmon, sockeye is key, make sure it's not Atlantic nasty salmon that's farmed, that's actually really bad for you, and then herring, so smash, those are all really healthy fatty acid, omega-3 dense uh, fish you can prioritize, some grass-fed beef is great, some eggs, some pasture-raised eggs with a healthy runny yolk, don't cook the yolk, those types of foods are going to help a ton, coconut oil, uh, some grass-fed raw butter if you can, you know, these types of foods are foundational. You know, they're really foundational in your diet. So make those uh, at the top of the totem pole. Extra virgin olive oil, I forgot to mention, is also one of my favorites every single day, like two to five tablespoons of some good quality, single sourced, organic, cold pressed extra virgin olive oil. Monounsaturated fats, it's in a longevity diet like the Mediterranean diet. And avoiding the blood sugar rodeos, right? So just avoiding eating the high blood sugar from hyper processed foods, cut those things out and start integrating these healthier foods so you can have that steady flow in blood sugar throughout the day and that high energy. Now, another thing I'll mention is minerals. Minerals are so important as well. So we have some of the things I mentioned with antioxidants, the healthy fatty acids, now minerals. So minerals are helping you with your electrical signals. They help with your circuitry in your body and they help with combating a lot of these EMFs. And so really getting a widespread amount of these minerals from healthy nutrient dense salt. You know, I'm not a huge fan of most salts in the market. They're contaminated with microplastics or they have high amounts of iron oxide residues, basically rust. And so what is a good source of uh, overall salt? Well, you can focus on Redmond Real Salt or Celtic. I even mentioned this in my last video uh, regarding vascularity and improving your blood flow but I'm huge on getting a good sufficient amount of salt in every day. Uh, Redmond is a great source of this and I'm a big fan of their electrolyte powder every single morning and sometimes twice or three times even a day to give you those gnarly pumps in the gym, helping out with absorbing the water. It's really delicious as well. You can get flavored ones. I usually mix the unflavored and the flavored to help out with the, you know, the seawater taste, but really helpful right there. You can get 15% off with CVC Wellness at redmond.life. Another part of that is magnesium. I'm huge on getting magnesium in. 
Uh, 70 plus percent of individuals are deficient in magnesium. There's over 300 enzymatic reactions from ma magnesium ranging from bone density to nervous system regulation to helping out with sleep, overall stress and brain function. So uh, magnesium breakthrough is a great one to get because it has all seven forms of magnesium. Uh, plus the cofactors, vitamin B6 to help absorb it and fulvic and humic acids to further help absorb it. You can get this off, uh, get this on uh, bioptimizers.com and use code CVC wellness for 10% off. These are affordable supplements. I'm just providing you easy, low expense things that can help you on this journey. I'm not selling you anything. If you are interested, just reach out, comment below. Uh, if you have questions about these things, but I love sharing supplements that are efficacious, they're clean, they don't have nasty chemicals or fillers. So check those ones out. Now let's dive into some technology that can help mitigate this EMF and modulate it, making it more favorable for your body and your overall system. There's many on the market and a lot of them promote it as being this like powerful thing to reduce the EMFs and make them more favorable for your body, but they have no research to back it up. So I'm, I'm all about that research backed stuff. And these ones that I'm gonna to present to you here in a moment are backed by countless studies, peer-reviewed third-party tests that have really made it crystallize into an effective product. And many people that actually buy these products and have them in their aura at their workstation, bringing, them, bringing it with them when they travel on planes, et cetera, they have noticed a big difference with anxiety, with focus, with overall inflammation in their body. They feel the difference in these things. So the first one I'm gonna bring up is this crazy, beautiful little device right here that has a copper plating on it. There's 25 plus studies on it and has this awesome wood around it. It's the Key Shield. The Key Shield is backed by 25 studies and it helps polarize or depolarize a lot of these harmful EMS. And it has this crazy patented technology in it I've noticed after having this for about a month now in my uh, workspace and taking it with me on flights, I'm traveling to Denver tomorrow. I'm gonna be taking this with me on the flight because it has a 16 foot radius to depolarize a lot of these harmful EMFs. So you can check this one out for yourself. It's a powerful thing to get and put in your arsenal. And another one you can check out is Aries Tech. They have a ton of these devices, one that you can stick on your phone, you can put around your neck and carry with you. And these little devices have a crazy technology in it with little microprocessors that help mitigate and modulate and turn these wavelengths into more favorable ones. Because if we just block the wavelengths, we won't have cellular signals, right? So it's about converting them into ones that actually stick and click with our biology. So Aries Tech is amazing. I carry this with me everywhere I go. This is a cool product. You can check both of these ones out. I'll put them in the link uh, below in the caption and learn more about these products. They're really powerful ways to help modulate these uh, potent effects in your body because we all want to feel good and this is one of the simple ways to go about it. Well, there you have it, Wellness Warrior. A ton of different things you can put in your arsenal when it comes to mitigating EMFs and living a longer life in tune with these devices that really help us connect. And you know, right now I wouldn't be able to connect with you if it weren't for them. So I love them. They've helped me expand social media. They've helped me really speak my truth and support you guys on this journey to natural living and vitality. Please subscribe, hit that notification bell icon so you get further updates on videos coming out through your email. It's amazing. And speaking of email, subscribe to my email. If you want a free guide, it's a lifestyle guide with a primal workout. It also contains a seven minute journal and you get a grocery list in there free of charge, all for you. And every single week on top of that, I share a powerful email based on a range of topics that I enjoy that can help you out in this journey, ranging from nutrition to lifestyle to fitness. It's really cool stuff. So like this video too. You know, the little likes spews it out into the algorithm and the World Wide Web to help me help more people. I'll see you guys on the other side of wellness. Peace and love.